So first of all, let's talk about what the prism is. That's what it looks like if you haven't seen it. And I'm sure that all of you have seen it, but hopefully very soon, isn't it? You're going to be able to use it, touch it and use it. We will be getting this in the market. If people are coming to our live event, they can get it in and in October. But yes. And then even by next year, consumers can buy it. So we're super excited about the Prism device. Now, the Prism is not, it's the first of its kind, but it has... A long, a history. long the, history. I think the history here, in this instance, but this, uh, with this particular device, is very critical for you to totally appreciate where we are today with Prism. Okay, if you recall, uh, we obviously have uh, a device that we call the Biophotonic Scanner. Uh, I believe we launched that back. Oh, oh my goodness, it's almost twenty years. It's two thousand and three. The original scanner, I call it. We call it the S one. Essentially, it took up a whole room to be able to measure. At that time, we called them the carotenoid antioxidants. And then we brought it down to this sort of toaster size thing. And now finally, we had the, uh, the S3, which is the current device or version that is in, uh, right. in use right now. But remember, 20 years ago, we all we knew at that point in time, the technology was measuring antioxidants. In fact, specifically uh, these carotenoids.